Hidden Object Guru here with hot new game Demo, The Beast Inside. I would hope there would be differences in the final version. Uh, we're just going to give this a brief look. We want to get a sense of the wonderful visuals. We want to get uh, feel what the gameplay is like. And then if it looks like we're wanna, going to want to check out the full version, we will... Uh, hit them up for a copy of that and play it through here on the channel. I know DM's always looking for horror stuff to try. And this game, which is about like I'm begging you. Cold War stuff Please. and Leave me alone. revolutionary American stuff apparently. What have I done to you? Or maybe what, Civil War? What do you want? Do you oh want my money? god. You can have it. You can Ah. Oh. You can have it. Anything you want, please. How is this the way the game is starting? I won't tell anyone. You're wearing a mask. I, I don't even know what you look like. Please, please. My husband, Adam. Oof. He should be back any minute. Oh, come on. No, no, no. What do you, what do you need to ask for? Please. I'm begging you. Okay. So is the guy in the mask actually Adam? Yeah, it's uh... Although it would have been great if it had gone uh... If the flashback had been three minutes earlier instead of one so week earlier. Getting away from the urban sprawl. Moving will make us feel better here. One day you'll thank me for that. Oh. Uh, no. So, just remember to fill up the car this time, Emma. Except your husband is obviously going to get possessed by a demon and murder you, so. Oh, sweetie. A little walk in some fresh mountain air would be good for you. <laughs> Plus, you could lose some weight. <laughs> Damn. Get on it. I'm working on it, okay? Look at him. We're finally here. Oh, it's wonderful. Anytime I see houses like this out in the woods, my first thought is invariably, I wonder what a, how much of a hassle it is to get power lines out here. So, let's get to work. Hey, Jaden, what's up? What game did you get? Someone boarded over the, uh... Well? Just FYI. Don't open that up. That's where the uh, immortal Jesus. monster is held. Alright, so... I guess I'm bringing that upstairs. Yeah, this house is not in great shape. Is that a fireplace poker? No. It's a hook. Nice. I don't know why there's locked doors in my house. But okay. Oh, Valkyria Chronicles 4 is the best. Aww. They give you your objectives. What a nice way to do that. Is it really necessary to hold on to all of these shoes? That says kitchen cutlery. Can Adam not read? I suddenly suspect that Adam can't read. The hell's Christmas in decorations. Your shoes? Again, Christmas decorations. So Adam thinks he's funny? You're not funny, Adam. Oh, you actually have to pull the mouse down. That's nice. Let's take a step back so it doesn't wang me in the head. No, we're good? Okay. Sword Art Online Hollow Realization. That's a pretty good title. It's locked. It's locked. Nice 
Trudy, do you have the key for this? I am trashing those Christmas decorations. I will. Which I definitely know where that is. Not available in this version. Okay. Well, at least they're honest about it. Not like... I like how other doors we just locked. This one, not available in this version. You could have just made the doors lock, guy. Aha. Uh -huh. Carpeting. Nice. So I can pick up and interact with most things. So let's pick this up. That says, I'll prepare for major weather. Oh no! There's going to be a tragic storm that freaks everybody out. I do like that. Good looking house. Although, I have literally said that about, I would say, 70%, maybe 80% of the games I've played may built in... Uh, uh, sorry, built in Unreal Engine 4, so it's not really a shock that I would love this thing. At least visually speaking. So is this not the dining room? Ooh, a letter. Uh, house belonged to my family. Ah, show text. Stevenson's Refuge, nice. Damn. That's weird. So, um, the, the family has lived in this house since time immemoria, 300 years ago. And as a consequence, there are buried secrets beneath it that we will uncover. Leading to a brutal murder. Also, a, ba a bald guy gets stabbed in, the, stabbed in the head at some point. Yeah, I did. Uh, Jaden, I hope you really enjoy... Uh, Valkyria Chronicles. I know I did. Alright. So, we can't get into this room, which is not the dining room. Although, honestly, with that chandelier up there, it kind of looks like a dining room. Yes, can I get in through the window? Oh, I can't see in through the windows. Damn it. It's got to be around here somewhere. All right, so. And then Hoguru failed to... F oh, I like it when you can manually open and close doors. All right, so let's assume this is the dining room. It's got a fireplace, so I don't know that it is, but let's assume... Um, I don't think they had recycling bins in the 1960s. No. Or is this set in the present and they're just driving a really old car and listening to doo-wop music for no reason? Huh. So the movers also ate pizza. What are you looking for? On the box, that is a modern shipping label. That's true, it's got a barcode on it. This game might be uh, made out of anachronisms, but again, they might be hipsters. Absolutely, Jaden. Although, obviously, I can't speak for Hans. Gosh darn it. Check in the dining room. Cigarettes, you say? Lucky stars. I guess that's what we can thank? Ha ha! No? Okay. Okay. Are there any rooms I've missed? I checked all of the drawers in the dresser. I checked on top of here. Alright, so we're looking on top of that table. There's nothing. I'm going to stop running around. We looked on top of this. It's not in any of the open box. It's not on the chairs. not on the windowsills. It's not under the pizza box somehow. Not on the fireplace mantle. 
Uh, not in this box. Ah, I didn't open these drawers. I don't see it in the dining room. It's not here. Right, I, I must have left them in the car. Ah. Oh, there's nothing in the secret container. That's disappointing. Well, let's check out the license plate. If it's a modern license... No, look at how old that license plate is. It's the actual 60s. Oh. Nice little sound effect for the explode, uh, for the closing door. Alright, trunk indicator. Alright, if you were... Aha! House keys. Ah, Thank you. There it is. Now I'll just put you back, because I'm not a monster. Ooh, I can open my in inventory. Come on, we got this. That almost worked. Okay. Oh my god, you can use hints! Dear developers, I love you now because you put a hint system in your adventure game. Which frigging, I would say 70 to 80% of developers refuse to do. They're like, no, make them go to the internet for walkthroughs. I'm like... Why do you hate the people who want to play your game? They bought your game. They want to play your game. Why are you making that hard? If they want to figure... If they're the kind of person who wants to figure it out for themselves, great. If they're not, who cares? Yeah, we all just saw the knife there, right? Uh, let's see what we have here. Oh, I will in a second. Hey, murder knife, murder knife, murder knife. I see you. Later, you're going to get stabbed in the severed head of a dude. Right now, you're just a knife. Do we need to find a crowbar? We're just mm -hmm. popping this up. I guess I'm going to need a tool to pry open this plank. Wow, he found a mystery very quickly. Okay. Like, he moved into the house and what? Eight minutes later, he found his first mystery? So can I use the knife to pry open the plank, or no? I cannot. Is there a crowbar up? Oh, hello, Mr. Door. Nothing. Hmm, out of my way, I need to look around. Let's go back downstairs, look around the shed outside. Maybe that's a good place to keep a crowbar. I mean, that's where I would keep a crowbar. More notes! Simon and Sons moving service. Well, how could they put the boxes in the attic if we had the keys? Huh? Probe renovation, 70 miles in one way. Customer signature, Adam Stevenson. Roof signature, Daubney. Fascinating and logical, too. Home cooking. Yeah, it's got barcodes all over it. Someone did not educate the people who made this game about what life was like in the 1960s. What, uh... How shall I put this? Um, commercial art looked like in the 1950s? Here, shed, 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 shed. And abridged, you didn't miss, must, uh, miss much. We went up into the attic, now I'm looking for a crowbar. Sadly, there will not be a hidden object scene to help me get one. Kind of got stuck in a depression there, that was bad. There's no jump button, so there was no clear way to get out of it. Oh, it's locked. <coughs> Excuse me. Kind of like that you can move everything in the game world. The dream of Trespasser has finally been made real in the game The Beast Inside. We didn't think this is where it was going to be made real, but it's where it was. So now, I can wander around trying to figure out where the crowbar is, or I can say hint. Oh, the crowbar was in the attic. Okay, now I feel silly. Probably should not leave the car wide open. I know there's not a lot of people out here, but, and this is something that they're not going to tell you in the forestry service, deer have been known to steal cars. 
All right, so crowbar. Aha! Well, I can't open that for some. Oh, there's a tarp in front of it. All right, I'll keep looking. Honestly, the faster we get a crowbar in any game, the happier we are. Because there's always something to be done with a crowbar. Just as a general rule. Where the hell are you, crowbar? Is it on top of the shelf? No, that's a meat cleaver. Wow, they're really showing you all of the weapons that are going to turn up later in the game in that uh, opening sequence, huh? Kind of, uh, not saying uh, it's it's excessively dark, but it's pretty dark. Oh, hello! It was up the ladder. Can I crouch to get in there? Oh, good, there's the axe. Yep, all of the murder implements from later in the game are in the attic right at the start of the game. That's pretty cute. Alright, let's Please do this. Let it be money. Please let it be money. No, it's a it's an amulet that's gonna turn you into a serial killer. No serial killer amulet? Okay. That's a surprise. It's a puzzle box? Some sort of lament configuration? It might, mightn't it? But you're not going to let me uh, keep it. Part of the commentaries of the Gallic War written by Julius Caesar. Okay. Rotate to find hidden message. Well, the... Damn it, I should have read that first. Rotate to find hidden message. Looking more closely at the same object as recover many long summaries. Cast new light in the perfect image. Find hoo hoo to reveal the message. J equals C. That's right. Document investigation. Cipher disk. Nice. So there's only four letters. And those letters are... Uh, who's got a pen? Anybody got a pen and piece of paper? Hold on. I'm getting a pen and a piece of paper. Uh, M. Okay. R. A. Rapti. Rapts. Rapted. G. A. Did you just make the mistake of trying to pull and look at what I was doing, but you were too locked to your headset? Yep. All right, that, that I was happened. hoping you hadn't noticed. Okay. Uh, hmm. G A gap. Gappled, gappy, gaply. All right. So, there you go. So, what are you trying to spell? A word. I suck at this. I didn't say you had to do it. I'm gonna check the uh, thing for notes. I'm gonna check the. Nails? Gales? G A I L S. G A I L S. I don't think Gales is, is that a word. An L or a U? That is a C. <laughs> wow. Wow. You have the worst handwriting. That's famously true. Uh, there's an H. Oh, okay. Hmm. Could end it with T H. Oh, there's a th at the end. Yeah, th. Okay, so. Th. So. Rap. No, ra wraith. No, that's r a i t h. That's another word. Faith. faith. Spells faith. There you go. It's pro the answer is probably faith. F. I. There you go. You're welcome. We did it! Thank you for finding that TH at the end. You're welcome. That was going to take me a while because I was going to run through all of them. And weirdly, I stopped when I got to G because I'm a dummy and I had to let you look at it. That was literally... <laughs> literally. I'm, I, I give up too early. I think that's... Is that famously true? Give up too quickly on puzzles? Hey, I'm going to keep playing this impossible level that the game makers told me was just meant to torture people. I did beat it, though. Uh, what does this antique key unlock? 
All right, we got a notebook, everybody. Property of Nicholas. June seventh of September, eighteen sixty-four. Oh, flashback! We're becoming a character in a flashback, everybody. See, he's going to learn that it's the history of family to always turn into werewolf serial killers. And so now he's going to do that. This place looks exactly like on the day I left it. So many years have passed away. He's back from the Civil War, you see. Only the overwhelming silence helps me distinguish past from present. Maybe the best would be not to think about it. I better check if everything is in its own place. It is getting late. I should oh, find hell. to light up while there's still some light. They told me that it would be a good idea to start writing down everything. So be it. They know better than I do. Oh, no. This guy's home from the war, and what he doesn't know is that his uh, house has now been infested by werewolves. Is that true? Probably not, but... It's what I want to have happen. And every now and then that turns out to be true. Why, look, it's the most uh, match-based gameplay we've seen since White Knight. That's a hilarious reference for anyone who remembers the game White Knight. So it's a hilarious reference for no one. What did I just pick up? Was that a tank of kerosene or something? Ah, there we go. Candelabra with no candles on it. What has my maid been up to? Oh! It's an otter! Someone's got a stuffed otter! Oh no, wait. Might be some sort of weasel. Forget it. Not cute. Take that, weasel. Well, this is getting creepy. What is this? Pyrite mine photo. Oh, they ran a pyrite mine. Nice. I assume pyrite is an important uh, component in the production of something. Because when I think of pyrite, I think only of iron pyrite, the uh, fool's gold. Can I use it with the... Uh, damn it. I was hoping I could use the candle with the... Alright, well that's just not happening. Mental note, do a trick shot video later of me trying to land these candles sitting uh, upright. It will never work. All right, so where are we now? Oh, heavy objects, hold the left. Oh. Nice. Kind of out of space there, buddy. You know, I could have used one match to light both of those. God damn, the Unreal 4 uh, lighting engine does some amazing things. Uh, yeah, I'll take the lamp. What the hell is that? That is an angel with a wheelbarrow, everybody. The most relatable Hummel figurine of all. <laughs> Alright, what's this? Okay. Exactly, candle flip challenge. Whew. My father bought this land for next to nothing. His friend, Judge Norton. Probably a, a name, not a judge. Oh, okay. Rotate to find a hidden message. My father knows ground. He just needs someone who had the means of operating the mine here. That's when he met George. Later, he built the inn and made stacks of money. Oh. Did they steal this land from somebody? There's someone out there who's super angry about having the land stolen who's going to try to serial kill me. 
And we're going to have to defeat them, thereby becoming beasts ourselves. Beasts inside. No, that's definitely not the plot. Okay. Sorry. I cannot read that. Oh, whatever. Can't move that either. What's there? It is a bloody book. All right. Okay. Oh, wait. Do I have to spend a candle to turn? The hell was that? I think it came from upstairs. Yes, let's absolutely walk upstairs and check out a giant deadly thump. This can only go well for everyone. Okay, it's just the wind, everybody. I love that none of these things are breaking as I toss them around. Mental note, before you go to what has the slightest chance of being a spook house, buy like 50 matches. And by matches, I mean boxes of matches. 50 boxes of matches, which should be about 2,000 matches. That should handle you for the first two days. Damn draft. I thought that this window had been fixed. Well, you've been away fighting the Civil War, so... <laughs> Jesus! Come on! Who's there? Are you lost? Who the fuck is that? Yeah, I don't know that he would have been saying who the fuck is that in the year 1864. But this game is anachronism the game, so there you go. Oof. All right. Let's go check it out. Hello? Anybody? I hope it didn't fall down that well. <sighs> well, if he did, that's his problem. Yes, I'd better. What are the odds that there's a severed head down that well? Oh wait, it doesn't seem to be attached to anything. There's no rope. Oh good, the, round is t the ground is terribly muddy. This can only go well. Now when you say you have to check your... I thought I was supposed to check the shed, but it was locked. I don't have a key. Wow. Did they have those kind of fold-over matches in 1864? I have no idea. Cardboard matches, I mean, not wooden matches. That was an eerie sound. Is someone leave a key somewhere? Oh, look back there. There's another light source. Oh, this is the shed they meant. There were two sheds, everybody. The barrel didn't have a bottom in. That's weird. Is this where they've been keeping the werewolf? 
Because I'm not okay with that if it is. Wow, it's the axe and crowbar that's going to be so important to my character later on. No, that's just a hatchet. The axe is missing. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, good. So the family has always had a torture dungeon. Did I need to cut through a chain? So, somewhere beneath the house is a torture dungeon that my family loved using to kill people. And, uh... This guy gives me the creeps. Good point. Ain't it the truth, Phoenix? Come on! What are you doing in my house? Hey, come back here. Yeah, don't say come back here. That was a ghost that obviously disappeared into the ghost ether. You know, as opposed to the regular ether, the ghost ether. Hey, all the lights went out. Oh, this is bad. So I guess this light maybe has a flint starter of some kind? Is that a thing? That lanterns can have? Like starters? Come on, cigarette box. God damn it, these cigarette boxes are all empty. No, not there. Huh. Oh, hello, it's another note. Jack and Nicholas, May 12th, 1843. Wow. I want to know more about their inn. So his father, a violent psychopath who loves cutting people up in the basement and now the house is haunted as a consequence. Because he cut too many people up in the basement. Hey, Wonder Girl, we're playing the demo of the beast inside, which is freely available on Steam, I want to remind everyone. If you want to go check this out for yourself, you need only go to Steam and download the demo. They do not have an announced release date yet, but I'm very excited to check out the full version of this game. The door is blocked somehow. Oh, good. The kitchen's open. Okay. <sighs> that was intense. We got a poltergeist running around. Hey, that's what I always do. Putting uh, cups... Uh, what do you call it? Uh... Sorry, candles inside of mugs. Although they didn't put water in the mug the way I did. Because if you put water inside the mug, then uh, if it ever gets knocked over, the water extinguishes the flame immediately. It's very handy. Oh, come on. This game is getting too intense. Whew. 
Whew. Oh, good. Well, that's bad. Maddie, I did try using, um, I've been using OBS to, uh, stream my writing streams, and it's been working okay. I downloaded whatever the newest OBS was, and honestly, had no problems with it. Streaming like clockwork for the writing streams on Twitch. Okay, I think the woods might be scarier than whatever's behind that door. Oh, there's blood everywhere. I may have to take back what I just said about it being scarier than whatever's un behind that door. See, now that I've pulled the uh, thing away, I can circle around. Wish me luck. How do I work these? Alright, Mr. Ghost, stay back. I have a lamp. I think he might not be impressed about my lamp. Oh, good. It's the torture dungeon we were just talking about. <laughs> oh, that was great. What the hell is going on here? Well, your, your dad killed people in a torture dungeon, and now you're paying the price for his crimes. I'll be honest with you. It happens a lot. It's, a, it's honestly a pretty common way to spend an afternoon back in the past. So can I use the kerosene to add to the thing, or use? Oh, okay, there we go. Behind that barrel? No, huh? Also no. You say that, Wonder Girl, but uh, wolves have were uh, sorry, woods have werewolves in them. <laughs> so I don't know if they're not uh, if houses are scarier. Oh, it's a horsey! Stop knocking stuff over, sinister ghost creature monster. Again, it's something that some of these guys do in uh, Unreal Engine games. They'll just like, let's make everything pick upable. Of course, that means it would be possible to like build a giant wall of bottles to keep you from opening a key door, but then you could always just move them again. Okay, here we go. Damn it. I feel like werewolves are going to see through that, but, you know, I may be overestimating the skills of werewolves. Okay. I'm just imagining reading this in... Oh, good. It's a creepy painting. Exactly what we were hoping to find. Sorry, creepy painting. You're going to have to face the floor for a while. Let me guess. Go find the key. Yes. I feel like this basement is, like, has a footprint of twice the size of the house. I'm ashamed to know you on a bridge. Ashamed. 
The door is locked. When did the door get locked? That's what he meant by I have to get out of this damn basement. He knew the thing was locked, even though in the game I didn't actually go and check that. I just started adventuring in the basement. See, that one's better. So, where's the study? Hint, get out of the basement. Seriously? I need a lock pick. Okay. Where would a lock pick be? Which, by the way, that is that is the least him helpful hint ever. Find a basement. Sorry, find a lock pick. I wouldn't know how to do that in real life, let alone a video game. Although, I mean, realistically speaking, I can probably order a lock pick on eBay. Uh, true lockpick sets are illegal to have unless you have a certain license in most areas. Nice. All right, here we go. Yes, there is. So how do I open it? There we go. Lockpick kits. That is a probe and a tension wrench. See? I know what the parts of a lockpick are. I pay attention to movies and television shows and books. I looked away when the scary thing happened, so when it came, when I looked back, the scary thing had already happened. If you're wondering why he didn't yelp that time, Wonder Girl says howdy. Howdy. Alright, let's pick that lock. With a mini game! Alright. Lock it quickly with the mouse click. Place the lock, pick below one of the cylinders using the mouse. Move up and down to raise the cylinder. Shear line, block quickly with a click. Lock all the cylinders to open the lock. Time is wrong, the cylinders will fall down. Oh, whoops. Remember the lock pick simulator? What game was it the, on the DS? Oh, what game was that? The Lawyer Phoenix. Yes, it was in one of the Phoenix Wright games. The amazing lockpick uh, yeah. gameplay. This one's pretty good. Damn it! There's a lot of games that try to do lockpicking. This one seems to be doing a really good job. Soft touch, Ogre. Whew! Did someone put that back up against the wall? What is going on in this house? So if you were your father's study, where would you be? Was he looking for in there? He found socks, then he left them on the floor. Let's uh, refill that lantern. Look around here a little. Those are some spooky ass noises. No, nothing doing here. Where are you? God damn it, game. Should not be this hard to find a study. Oh, this is the study. All right, I'm dumb. We had already found the study. <laughs> Either would be good on given the circumstances. A 
Okay, I found the study. Can you give me a tip about what I'm supposed to do now? Yeah, it's really unclear what you want me to do now, game. Follow the blood trail? What blood trail? There was a blood trail? Oh! Bloody footprints. Well, you know, you didn't tell me to... Oh, crap. There we go. I have no idea why I took it to that, to that place where I've spent the last decade. I don't even remember which lock it fits. What? what? Uh, we were attacked by a phantom woods man. Okay, well. I'm obviously down for more of this. Anyway, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. The, this has been The Beast Inside. Uh, if you guys want to check out the uh, demo, you're free to do so yourself. Assuming your computer could run it, I would check the uh, that first. Uh, okay. Adam. Oh! <laughs> Way to give away your twist ending. When you told us the by telling us that it's the same guy doing the voice of Adam and the murderous lumberjack. Mm. Seriously though, uh, I will give you my feedback later. Anyway, uh, like I said, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. This has been the Beast Inside. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, there's buttons for that coming up. Questions, suggestions, related whatnots go in the comments section below the video. We'll see you back here for the full version of this game in the next item on the playlist. But until then, au revoir.